that uh, Castle Hill has become such an important part of the, the exercise routine of so many folk that live in Townsville and we saw uh, tourists using the, the, the hill and ultimately with all that traffic and with all that activity accidents happen. The ability to find them quickly to be able to, uh, to rescue them and, and give them first aid as quickly as possible. That was the agenda for the markers and we're very proud of the project. Uh, you know, we worked in consultation with the council as well as the EMS to basically deliver all of the stakeholders exactly what they're looking for. As far as what the signs are, the, uh, uh, the intro signs are effectively at the beginning uh, of, uh, of the major trails and that's really just a, a recognition of the Rotary Club's uh, involvement with the project. Project. The, the physical markers that will occur every 100 metres are effectively very similar to your roadside uh, um, warning markers, but each one is labelled with a distance as well as the name of the track, as well as being colour coded. So uh, effectively we're trying to make it as foolproof as possible. Financially, uh, we applied uh, for a grant from Rotary District 9550 and the amount that was forthcoming there was $8,000 and the, uh, the Rotary Club itself contributed another uh, $6,000 to that overall project as far as the financial cost of purchasing the trail markers and in addition to that we'll also be contributing uh, around ten, twelve thousand dollars $12,000 of work in kind in as much as Rotarians will be the uh, the people who will install the, the mountings for the trail markers. So yes, when it's completed, uh, uh, we'll have a, a hill that's suitable for everybody to use, that's safe, and when somebody needs rescue, we'll know exactly where they are and how best to get to them.